Alrighty, Femi Films, let's see what you need to know. I hope everybody's having a good day, Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine, there is going to be a class slash uh, meeting for the month of November. It will be 3333. Uh, on this class, we're going to discuss... Oh, did I say take your love vitamin? Take your love vitamin. We're going to go over gifts and abilities, talents, how to use those things and make money to provide for ourselves, our families, and help um, manifest a better life and for ourselves and our community. 3333, you will have an hour with me. If you book the class, make sure you email your questions. Okay, I'm going to link everything in the, um, in the comment section. I haven't posted the flyer for it yet, um, but it's going to be mid-November on Zoom. All right, let's see what you need to know. Patience is a virtue. Don't rush it. Don't rush yourself. Don't rush someone else. You know, I see a cake. You know how a cake is done on the outside. Something in the inside is still cooking. Something is still being worked out. It's not over. It means don't give up. Accept struggles as lessons. So right now you may be in that in-between season. It doesn't mean that you have failed, that you're failing. It just means that this is meant to push you. Do not get weary in your well-doing. Have an attitude of gratitude. Your attitude is determining your altitude. So this is just all that motivation that you need to keep going, keep trying, keep pushing. Just don't it doesn't have to happen right away. It doesn't always happen right away. Holy Spirit, give them something on the patience is a virtue. What do you need to know? Page of Pentacles. Good news is coming. But one thing about the Page of Pentacles is good news is coming. Good things are coming. Great things are going to happen. The Six of Pentacles, it moves a little slow. Some of you all, it's something about your tangible needs, something that you need, not or something that you truly desire. So it's almost like, you know, how long is this going to take? How much longer am I going to have to wait? There's no time saving. There's no due date. You're going to have to persevere. All right, Holy Spirit. But guess what? Good news is going to bring you great stability. Holy Spirit, what else do the divine feminine need to know? Yep. The nine of cups. Wish fulfillment is coming. The nine of wands. Now, some of you all, let me tell you this straight. Now, for those of you all that's dealing with the situation where you've been trying to put in many hands, too many eyes are in the fire. It's like somebody here is a jack of all trade. You got to discover that one thing that works for you, not only your niche, but your passion in it. So it's like I see somebody here trying to figure out, okay, I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this. I'm going to try nine different things. But the reason why things are going slow, because you're too busy trying too many things and you're not discovering what's really working for you or what's working against you. Those of you all dealing with a relationship, you're trying to figure out if a person's trying to play over you or play with you, only time. Time and the time and the experience is going to tell you who a person is. So there's no set in stone. Yes, this person is a player. Yes, this person is dogmatic. Somebody here is non-committal, but this person also has a lot of regrets. This is a person that's going to want to reach out and call some of you all or reconcile. But guess what? This is also a person saying, I wish I wouldn't, I wish I would not have done something. For some of you all, you are also going to get a text message from this person. Um, this is also a person that may be testing you if it's safe to come towards you, if it's safe to communicate with you. Somebody here has been taking their time, like waiting for you to deal with something, accept something, get over something, be willing to communicate with them. That's on relationships. Others of you all, you're manifesting yourself to a better place. Love bug, just don't rush yourself because you don't want to uh, make a mess. I also see eggshells. You know how you're cracking eggs, putting it in the cake, and you're rushing. I see shells of the egg and the cake. So I'm hearing don't make a mess. Don't make a mess. Don't be too much in a hurry. Allow things to come on through. Some of you are in a relationship that's dealing with someone with a player mindset, a player mentality or some sort of player ways, this person right here is coming around, but you need to allow this person to be who they are. Just because they're a player does not mean they can play you. It doesn't mean you sit and wait on that person. The Holy Spirit is saying, you live life. You may meet somebody else. This person has to decide, okay, I don't want to be a player no more. I can't just run around and play over any and everybody. Uh-oh. 
You're meant to be a lesson to a player to a player in their life. Yep, hold on. Uh-uh. It's something you're meant to teach this player. What's the Knight of Wands? Yep, the Ten of Swords. See, it ends with you. It, this, for whoever you are, if you're the one that's feeling bad because you're treating someone a certain type of way that plays games or thinks that he or she can play, play a game, your confirmation is you're meant to cut something off dead in its tracks. You're not meant to make a person feel comfortable trying you but so much sometimes a person trying you needs to be had so that you can see them for who they are this is past the red flags this is a person saying okay take this take that you're like no ma'am no sir you can stop it right there and this is somebody who that may be very slick or think he or she is slick and getting over on you because they think you're foolish or gullible or just unwise but you're meant to be a lesson to somebody so you're teaching a person a lesson now, i hear something about virginity celibacy abstinence maybe you're teaching this person what true people are for those of you all that are celibate abstinent or maybe even a virgin it's something you meant to teach this player because you're you got to put somebody it's it, somebody some of you all may have to put a person like i don't know if it's just hurt their feelings or just like nah i don't even get down like that no thank you no ma'am no sir um this could also be communication here but it's something that, that a person is a person supposed to be learning from you you may have them in their feelings is old oh, to hell well it's what it is now others of you all that's dealing with this rushing wanting something to happen is not over it's just that i've seen it seems like every time you get to the door the door closes no a closed door is a sign that it's not meant for you in that time it's not meant for you in that season it's not the right timing but it's coming see abundance is your birthright this is your north node. Something is going to bring you much happiness, much peace, much, stabi much stability. An offer from God is coming directly to you. Just don't rush it. Those of you all that a person wants to reconcile with you, stand your ground. Um, I also hear orders. You don't have to tell a person, I'm giving you orders. I also hear ultimatum. You don't have to say it's an ultimatum. Your boundaries work for you. Your standards work for you. But a great offer is coming to you. Don't feel bad because you, um, if you don't feel bad, if y'all not having sex, you ain't got to feel bad about that. That's your, that's your body. That, that's your body. Close this out, Holy Spirit. Yep. Guess what? Here's some phone calls coming through. Some of y'all going to see, receive phone calls, text messages, but something that you thought was over and dead, even something that you thought was not going to work out, not pretending to a relationship, it is. And this is you... I, for some of you all, you're working into your purpose, your life's purpose. It's just been a wait. A delay is not a deny. The three of wands, for some of you all, you had to wait on something. Mm-hmm. Now, it, let me say something about this relationship. Somebody here has been playing some games and lying. Yep. Th 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 there was a divine wait that had to happen in a poor relationship to manifest or materialize. Others of you all... It's divine timing because you are manifesting your life's purpose. You have, you're tapping into more or your life's calling. Six of wands. You're going to the next phase, the next level, the next process, the next, the next phase, the next stage of your life. But you can't allow yourself to be under processed. So your spirit guides are guiding you. I feel like somebody, I also feel, I want to say this to the person that has not been having sex or has told somebody no, you needed to tell them no because they needed to understand the purpose of waiting. If you sleep with a player, they're only going to look at you, they're not going to look at you any different than anybody else. You're achieving something that many people do not. Yep. And I feel like for those of you all that are breaking players down, you're breaking them down because you're doing something that other people don't do. Tell them no. Some of you all, this is how you're manifesting your divine masculine. You're not only manifesting this person in, in the physical, but you're manifesting respect. See that power card? You're summoning power. You're in a power that you need to be in. All right. Holy Spirit, close this out. Damn, check out the, um, the uh, comment section for the classes for next month. Yep. Sacred action. 
sacred. You, you, you have a reverence for yourself. Your body is sacred. You know it. Your mind is sacred. You know it. This journey, this calling, this, this path is sacred. You know it. The wings of light. This is happening when it's supposed to happen, how it's supposed to happen. Those of you all that's working on things, getting to the next phase and stage, manifesting these uh, achievements, promotions, it's a brilliant idea. Also, I hear transfer. Don't be afraid to put in a transfer because you're going to get a yes. Just don't expect for it to happen overnight. It could take six weeks. It could take six months, but it's going to happen. Peace and blessing. Great day. I hope this helps films. Namaste.